What's up, everybody? So this is my first podcast. Uh, what is food chemistry? So without further ado, I'll get right into it. Um, second slide. What is food chemistry? Food science is the discipline in which biology, physical sciences, and engineering are used to study the nature of foods, the causes of their deterioration, and the principles underlying food processing. All right. So what does a food scientist do? Well, a food scientist studies the physical, microbiological, and chemical makeup of food. Depending on their area of specialization, food scientists may develop ways to process, preserve, package, or store food according to the industry and government specifications and regulations. Food chemistry is the study of the composition of raw materials within foods, the composition of the end products of food production, the changes that occur in food during production, processing, storage, and cooking stages. The three primary components in food are carbohydrates, lipids, and proteins. And I won't go into too much detail because I will make another podcast on those three, but I will give you a summary of each one of them. So the carbohydrates uh, make up a group of chemical compounds found in plant and animal cells. And lipids include fats, oils, waxes, and cholesterol. In the body, the fat serves as a source of energy, a thermal insulator, and a cushion around organs. And it's also an important component of, of the cell. All right, and proteins are also important components of food. And every cell requires protein for structure and function. Proteins are complex polymers composed of amino acids. Don't get too confused because I will go into them in, in depth with them later on. So let's go to slide six. So as we start diving into food chemistry, we'll come to phase vocabulary that you haven't seen before. So we'll get into some of the basics right now, the key terms. So at, at Antioxidant, antioxidants are substances that prevent or slow down oxidation, inhibits reactions promoted by oxygen, and is often used as a preservative. Amylase is an enzyme or protein in the saliva that breaks down the starch, and amino acids contain carbon, hydrogen, nitrogen, and sometimes sulfur. It serves as monomers to make peptides and proteins. There are 20 amino acids found in the body. Emotion is a property where two lipids are evenly spread out in each other, yet not dissolved in each other. Enzymes are important in production of foods that contain water and fat. These products require a emulsifier to stabilize food emulsions. And there are a lot more vocab that you should know, but I've uploaded them to my site. So I will put in the description box, but it is under my downloads tab. And it will help you a lot in the long term. So that's pretty much it for the first podcast. And I will see you next time.